So this is our source system. Okay, this is your target system. So this data we are moving from the source to target. Okay, for example, today we have the ten different computer cards are there. In the source system on twelfth one twenty twenty one twenty two, there are hundred records are there. Hundred transactions, maybe hundred records are there in the your source system on yesterday. These hundred records are moved into here. Okay, clear, guys. So these hundred records are moved, extracted, and then ingested into the data warehousing. On next day, on thirteenth one, there are some modifications happen on the existing data. For example, out of hundred. The twenty records are some modifications happen, changes happen on the out of hundred records, the twenty are the modified records. Some modifications happen, okay, okay. Eighty are the there is no modifications, plus twenty are the more some modifications, plus again thirty are the new records. Today new records. Total will be how many records are there, guys? One thirty records. Total will be one thirty records. Clear? Now tell me what is happen while loading the data from source to target. If you apply the SCD type one, what is happen here? Total one thirty records will be there. One thirty records. Yeah, because of the these are these twenty will be the existing record modified records. Okay, these twenty will be already is there already. This data is already available in my target table, my data warehousing. Okay, but some modifications happen. Okay, so these these type of records, if any modifications happen on the source system, source data, that records we are going to override into the target table. Clear? The modified records is going to override into the target table. The new records always is going to load into normal way. There is no A problem on the new records. These are these new records is not available in the. You are hit every one. Sorry, can you go on mute, please? Sir, no. So these thirty records are new records. So it's not going to the. Tar. Uh, sorry, it's not available in the target existing. So all uh, automatically these thirty records are going to load into the here. These twenty records are the modifying. Already available these twenty record. Now it is going to modify. Okay, these eighty records are the. There is no changes happen in the existing data, so as this is going to the here, that record is won't affect into the target side. Clear, guys? That is a SCD type one. If any modifications happen on the your source data, existing data, so it is going to override into the target table. Those records is going to override into the target table. We are not maintaining any history while applying the. A series type one functionality. Clear, guys. The same way, a series type two. A series type two. <coughs> the same day, hundred records are there here. First day. First day, hundred records are there. The same hundred records we loaded into the target. Okay. <coughs> Yeah. Yeah. Same hundred records loaded into target. Okay. Next day, it happened the changes same way. So eighty are the there is no changes existing data. Twenty are the modified data, and thirty are the new data. Now if you apply the SCD type two, if you apply the SCD type two, what is happen, guys? Tell me. One fifty entries will be there, sir. Total record entries. Okay, any other answers? One fifty. Two hundred thirty. Sorry, sorry, guys. Sorry. Tell me one more more time. Total record. Total will be one thirty. Okay. One fifty, sir. One fifty. Okay, one answer will be one fifty. Any other answers, guys? One thirty. 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 One
100 already existing right yeah, mm-hmm. i'll i'll wrote the answers here one is answer will be 130 another another answer will be 150 any mm-hmm. other answers guys from the team total 230 sir total 230 two, 230 records 230 okay one more answer 230 any other answers <coughs> sorry sorry this 80 is existing record or uh, uh, this 80 um, is existing see 80 20 uh, both are existing records only but 80 is there is no changes there is no modifications on the existing records 20 uh, are the some modifications sir, happen on the sorry sir there is no modification sir 80 80 there is no modifications 20 are the okay. modifications happen on the existing data this 30 are the new data new records 150 150 okay okay now we'll see what is the sri type 2 functionality guys any modification in the source data will be there and old data also will be there new record yeah any modifications happen on the the existing source, source data that data. records add as a new record every record in the target data yeah so the 80 records whatever the 80 records there is no modification means it won't affect anything here this 80 records already available in the my target and there is no changes so it will be as it is it will be there then this 20 records are some modifications happen this 20 records are the modifications happen this 20 records already available here okay but some modifications happen so as per the functionality sri type 2 functionality if any modifications happen on the existing source data that data is going to add as a new record means here is going to add the another 20 records this 20 records is a modified records okay we are going to maintain the history this is the old records 20 records here are the new records 20 records modification modified records okay this 30 will be as this new records this 30 records is not available in my target side first time i am going to load this 30 records so 30 records it will come and load okay what happened total record count 100 plus 30 30 plus 30 so 150 is the right answer so remaining will be wrong answers clear guys that is a sri type yes, two guys if any modifications happen on the existing data so that record is added as added as a new record here here if any modifications happen in the source data we are going to override it to the target here okay here we are adding as a new record that we have to explain in the properly correctly correct way we have to explain in the interview point of view or in the real time point of view you have to know understanding this concept clear guys yes sir next come to the sri type 3 so sri type 3 will be same scenario will take the same scenario for sri type 3 so what is sri type 3 so here we are going to maintain the partial original record and updated record with the effective date okay it is going to change the structure here okay for example here 100 records are there in the first time first day 100 records are there same 100 records is going to loaded into here the same scenario 80 are the 80 new record 80 mod, uh, the existing records there is no modification 20 are the modified records 30 are the new records now tell me guys if you implement the sri type 3 what happen here 130 sir okay one answer is 130 any other answers guys any other answers 230 okay 230 is another one, one more answer okay well stop with the any other okay no problem so wrong also we have to learn what why is it 130 why we said 130 130 sir okay okay so here what is this? can you guys go on me please so what is the one uh, sri type 3 means 
here we are maintaining the the structure is going to change and then we are maintaining the partial history we are not adding if any modifications happen we are not adding as a new record we are adding as a new column okay here we are adding as a new column so new based on the original information and updated information we are going to maintain as part of the scd type 3 right based on the effective date so in that case it won't come the any new new records here if any modifications happen also we are not going to add as a new records here okay now the count will be 130 only okay the count will be 130 only because of the, this 20 records is going to add as a new column that's it this 20 records what are the changes happen that adding as a new column with the same record, same uh, effective date so i'm going to show you yesterday what i explained This is what I explained. Yeah, this is your source data. For example, one record is there here. One record is 101 RAM Chennai, one record is there. That one record is loaded into target table, 101 RAM Bangalore. For example, is Chennai is there, then Chennai, original information. Okay, like that here both are the same. First time will be both are the same or it will be null. Okay. If any modifications happen, these changes is happen in the here is going to update that sheet. Okay, here we are going to update. We are not adding as a new record. We are not adding as a new record. This record only one record only it will be exist. The target side. For example, here again the Hyderabad is there. Happen Hyderabad. So it is going to change the Hyderabad here. This only is going to override. But we are not adding as a new record. Okay, we are not adding as a new record. Clear, guys? So that is the reason there is no change in the count. There is no change in the count. Whatever the count is there, the same count will be there here also. But we are maintaining a partial history here. We are maintaining a partial history. Okay guys, clear? SCD type 3.